I'm sure you're wondering what a state DA is doing here in federal court representing someone on the opposite side of the law. I am. This is highly unusual. I'm here as an officer of the court. This is Oliver Queen's current condition. He has been psychologically tortured, harassed, and assaulted. Upon information and belief, Mr. Queen also had the opportunity to escape Slabside, but instead smuggled information out to help his fellow inmates. And you feel these things should negate his conviction? Yes. Oliver Queen made a deal with the FBI to protect his city, but the FBI failed to hold up their end of the bargain. Meanwhile, Diaz has continued to commit numerous other crimes and nearly succeeded in murdering Mr. Queen's wife and child while they were in federal witness protection. Anything further, Ms. Lance? Your Honor, the hardest thing to do is to be a hero when no one expects you to be. The easier path is to be a criminal. The past six months, Oliver Queen has chosen the hard road and has been a hero in terrible conditions. And since the FBI has not held up their end of the deal, Oliver Queen deserves to be a free man. I agree that a federal investigation into the conditions of Slabside should be ordered. However, I'm unconvinced that Mr. Queen should be released at this time. Therefore, his conviction stands. Your appeal is denied. Dr.